Hey, haven't I seen you before? Hey, Broccoli Man. What up, homie? I am not a homie. I am a superhero. Are you here to get me out of this jail? No, homie. I am here to write about this in the Daily Journal. My job is to interview you about why you are a right, left, and center wing extremist. You are here to interview me and discredit my well documented facts. Do you not realize that if you do not listen to the real news stories and not use fish wrap like your newspaper, you will live under a one world government? We are all global citizens now. People who think they're just Americans are poor lost last century souls. Why are you against black people? You government chill. Just because I am against GMO foods and against TS body scans and also fight for personal freedoms we in America have, does not mean I am against any other race. Yes, it did. you did not vote for the president. You done did support Ron Paul. Are you serious? I work hard fighting crimes against humanity. My work on making sure TS does not see and feel up your junk when going to a grocery store. No one does a better job fighting for individual rights than me. Green dude, then if you want to fight crime, then why do you not become a global citizen? Even Congressman Hank Johnson in Georgia tells us about how Guam is going to tip over because there be too many peoples on it. If you loved the world, you would be feeling Hank Johnson. Are you sure you are a journalist? You were wearing toilet paper on your shirt. How dare you make fun of me? I work for the mainstream media. That's how come my newspaper is on my shirt. My work gets me on the TVs. If you did a good job, your stuff would be on there too. Obviously your stuff ain't that good. Oh my gosh. You were more stupid than I thought. Do you not know that the media is controlled by only a small group of people? And if you provide real news instead of reporting on two cats fighting over a tube of fluoride toothpaste, you are blocked from showing the truth. Newsweek recently had a cover of how the US lost the war in Afghanistan. However, in America, they had a story about why children are hyper. Do you not get it? There you go again with those racist comments G.I. am finna tell the president. I will even write on it in the papers. You don't know Jack G? I would recommend you check out why there is fluoride in the water. Please check why there are false flag attacks. You need to learn more about people like Soros and Kissinger. I get my news from real sources like CNN, ABC, CBS, and NBC. Just admit you ain't as good as me homie. Then you can help Hank Johnson get re-elected and make sure everyone becomes a global citizen. When we have a one world government, we can have one world religion, and we always can have a mark on our wrist to prove you are a global citizen. And if you choose to not be a global citizen anymore, your microchip will go off in your body, and you will die instantly. We have no more use for you if you ain't global. I am very much into people keeping their second amendment. The more people that own guns, the less crime that will be committed. Do you not realize if a criminal walked into a store, and 50 other people were armed, the criminal would not be able to get away with it? There you go with that hate speech again. No wonder why people don't listen to you. If guns were banned, then none of those people would have guns. You fool. You really think a criminal would not rob a store because owning a gun would be illegal? Do you not know that robbing a store is illegal unto itself? A criminal will still have access to whatever weaponry they need. Just look at Mexico, Chicago, and Washington DC. Guns are basically illegal there. Yet, gun crimes are the highest in those cities. Hey! Green pile of puke! Did I done tell you about talking in those racial overtones with me? I am most definitely putting this in our papers. You can't win an argument with me. I am the media. And even if you win, no one will know. I can write it up in the papers however I want. Unfortunately he is mostly right. Please help fight crime by going to freedomazyradio.com. Please check out the Proof Negative radio show and help us fight the new world order together. Otherwise, we are stuck with losers like this. Oh new one world government, how much I love it the pity on those who fail to realize we must enslave people to protect their freedoms.